realise this is obviously going to go down as a huge day in both your careers and the obvious question is how does it feel? Oh, I had the best in the house to be honest. Just, um, just uh, standing aside with all this great oh, players and to watch him go like his initial and also he helped me out along the way as well then. Couldn't, couldn't have been anyone better to bat with than Jamie, so it was, it was really really pleasing and to set uh, breaks and records is even better. Yeah, and it was your maiden handy, so you got upstaged really. Yeah, yeah, I was, <laughs> uh, it was my maiden uh, list of 100, so I was very happy with that and also to come out with the win, it's even, even more, you know, even better. Um, Jeep, how did you sort of feel when you went out there to bat? Did you think there was going to be a lot of runs in that wicket? No, no, you take it as one ball at a time and to be honest, early on I wasn't feeling as good as I uh, wanted to sort of I took the start. Sort of told myself, well, let's get down to the other end and watch Jamie bat because he was going pretty good. So, mm -hmm. and so I just took it as it went by and then it got easier and easier and then started, but things started falling in place later and uh, later in the innings. Did you kind of have a, a gut feel Jamie was going to go big? You knew it, yeah, <laughs> you knew it, yeah. It was one of those days where everything else was coming out of the screws. And I just said to him, stop batting too well because the opposition are giving me too much crap. <laughs> it's making me look like very bad. <laughs> so, no, it was a bit of a laugh. <laughs> Jamie, how were you feeling when you went out to bat? Yeah, I guess um, a little bit tired, I guess, you know, it was an early morning start. Um, uh, I, you know, I, I don't know, it was just another normal day, I guess, and, and um, things, we, we decided to be nice and positive at the start and, and it just kind of went from there. You were bold on a no ball, I think. Was that a nervous moment, or did you hear the call early? Yeah, I heard the call. Um, no, it was just, just uh, I think, sums up the day a little bit. Sometimes it's your day, and, and, uh, and other times it's not. Um, plenty of shots just went wider fielders, and you know, a few nicks went for four. So um, I guess uh, you know, when it's your day, you try and make the most of it. You look pretty solid, though, most of the innings. Yeah, there's a few night, you know, a few few good shots out of there that um, that uh, you know, obviously pretty pleased with, and, and um, but uh, you know, the, the, the win is the most important thing, and, and um, you know, the, the, the opening partnership was was pretty special to to uh, you know be out there with Jets, and, and um, um, you know, it's, it's nice to nice to be a part of, of his first one one day hundred, and, and um, hopefully many more. Were you aware of any of the records while the two of you were out there? No, we, obviously we knew it'd be pretty, pretty close to, to some records, but um, um, no, you know, you don't often get 300 as a as a as a, as a partnership. So um, I thought we were obviously going along pretty well, but um, uh, we were just trying to get as many as we could, and, and um, you know, at the end there we kind of have a few few little slogs and, and have a bit of fun at the end, and it just happened to go our way. How did you find out then that that was the second equal highest one day innings anywhere? Um, just just through uh, the media really, um, but um, yeah, you obviously don't go out to to, um, to break records or you know you obviously try and go out there and, and bat and, and score as many runs as you can and, and um, uh, it just happened to be our, our day today. How will it rate for you alongside the 139 for the Black Caps? Um, you know, scoring a hundred feet country is, is, I think, the ultimate. So, um, you know, it's certainly a different, um, a different feeling. Um, we ended up drawing that game, so uh, it's nice to come out of the win. But um, certainly today's is, is pretty special um, for, for different reasons. Yeah. Both of you must have been quite nervous towards the end there. I mean, that was not the predictable, if you like, finish to, to a game where you've scored over 400. Yeah, it was, uh, you know, Andy gave it to their, to their credit, it was, uh, gave it a really good shake and, uh, you know, a few boys, you know, I'm sure the bowlers were pretty, pretty nervous at the end and, and, the, and the fielders, but, um, you know, they obviously played really well. Um, but, you know, thankfully we, we just got just that, that much extra. Went down to the second to last over, incredible. Yeah, and, and, and uh, fantastic facilities, and, and uh, KJ, the groundsman, you know, got to take the hat off to him, and, and uh, small boundaries um, help a little <laughs> bit as well. Um, but um, yeah, a great day of cricket. You know, we we're obviously pretty happy to come out on the right side of it. Do you think you might both frame the scorecard from this one? <laughs> I don't know. We'd have to. We'd have to. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> A couple of years, we'll see how that happens. Yeah, yeah. A few memories will come out when he's, when he, when he's old and you know, having a few yarns with their young, with his grandchildren. So definitely one of those. Awesome. Congratulations to you both.
Michael. Thanks.